Hi there, Ryan Rastel here for Golfshake.com. We are on the 18th tee here at Dundonald Links in Ayrshire, Scotland. Talking a little bit about the different shots you're going to be faced with when playing Lynx golf. Luckily today, we've got a fairly benign day, not much wind, um, ideal conditions really for playing Lynx golf in, but should you be faced with a day where the wind picks up a little bit and there's a real premium on hitting fairways and changing ball flight, I'm going to give you a few tips on how to do that with a driver. Now, off the tee here, like I say, today I'm just going to hit a pretty normal driver tee shot down the fairway, so um, I'll show you that now. So I'm just going to hit a normal driver, show you the flight of it, and then I'm going to change little bits about my setup to try and flight the ball down that little bit and hopefully get it run a bit more. So normal driver swing, obviously got the ball teed up nice and high, ball right off the front foot here, and we're just going to put a normal swing on it, yeah? So hopefully nice high flight and get it going somewhere towards the fairway. So nice and high down the middle of the fairway, which is very unlike me. But if we need to change that for any reason because of the conditions, what I'd potentially do is tee the ball down a little bit more. So just push the tee that little bit more into the ground, get that ball a little bit lower there and also change little bits about my setup. So what I'm gonna try and do is get the ball slightly further back so it's not right off my front foot this time. I'm gonna get a little bit more back in the stance to take a little bit of loft off. I'm also gonna hit it that little bit smoother. So not quite hit it as hard as I did the first one. And speed is the key really. As soon as you try and hit a ball hard, generally it's gonna climb and spin and go a little bit higher, okay? So what I wanna do with this one is hit it a bit smoother, try and keep the flight down a little bit and a little bit flatter, and hopefully, Get that ball coming out a little bit lower. I'm also not going to swing the club back fully as well so I'm going to kind of stop my backswing about three quarters and try and keep get my hands up to sort of shoulder height and hopefully that's going to help me to flatten the ball flight out as well. So ball back in the stance of touch, shorter golf swing and hopefully nice and smooth and lower flight. And just like that, nice and low, running down the fairway and hopefully keep you in play on those windy days. <laughs> 